Hello friends and welcome to Coffee and Conversation. Encouragement for today. A ray of hope coming from the Gordon Avenue Baptist Church in Adel, Georgia. And there's just not a better place to find a ray of hope than in the light of God's holy and precious word. Today, friend, we'll be in the book of 2 Corinthians, chapter number 4, and we'll look at verse number 7 as a text verse. Notice what the Bible says here. But we have this treasure in earthen vessels that the excellency of the power may be of God and not of us. And friends, I pray that God would certainly add his special blessings to the reading of his holy word today. Get that good fresh cup of hot coffee. Let's sit together and have a wonderful encounter with God and his precious word on this beautiful day. Well, my goodness, friend, there's just not a better way to start a brand new day. Good, fresh, hot coffee and a fresh word from God. Today, friend, I want to bring to you a devotional thought that is titled, Useful. <clears throat> You know, friends, God can work through you. It is not only those extraordinary gifts or talents that the Lord chooses to be his representatives. On the contrary, God uses people who will humbly rely on his power to achieve his goals. The more dependent you are on God, the more his glory can shine through you. Of course, the temptation is to look at your faults and your failings and deem yourself unworthy of the Father's service. Friend, if you believe that, he cannot use you because of your past or your lack of resources or education or even your appearance then you need to realize that you are focusing on the wrong thing. Friend, the Bible is very clear. Your adequacy comes from God. The Lord can work through you to accomplish his wonderful purposes. And all he requires is for you to trade your weakness for his strength and to obey him. So, friend, place your faith in the Lord Jesus Christ and rejoice at all he does in and through you. You are useful. Remember that. And now let's pray together. Holy Father, thank you for creating us for your good works and thank you for working through us. May our lives bring you praise, honor, and glory as you make us useful 
every day. And we thank you for it. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ, our Lord. Amen and amen. Well, friends, I pray the devotion has been a blessing to you today. And remember, you are useful for the glory of God. You are useful. Let God use you. If the devotion has been a blessing to you, you bless someone else by sharing it with them, remembering that your life is the Bible that some will read today. So let others see and hear Jesus in all you say and in all that you do. Again, God bless you. Have a wonderful day.